our friends, we're gonna fold a dove. Yeah, we haven't done an origami project in a long time. Are you excited? Yes. We hope you guys are too. You need some origami paper for this project. But you, if you don't if you don't have origami paper, you could just use regular printer paper and then cut it into a square first. I really like origami paper because it's a lot thinner. Yes. And it's easier to use when we're folding it. But it's okay if you don't have it. We'll leave a link below this video though where you can go over to Amazon and purchase some. Now, first step, let's turn it over and we're gonna have it in a diamond shape. Then we're gonna fold, we're gonna take the bottom corner and we're gonna fold it up to the top. And if we ever go too fast during our origami projects, what can our art friends do? Pause the video. Yeah, you guys can always pause the video if you need to take extra time to complete a step. Now we're gonna take each corner and we're gonna fold it up to the center. That top little corner. So we're gonna fold one side and then we're gonna repeat that, fold the left side also. Now we're gonna take the top corner and we're gonna fold it down to the bottom corner. And do that with both sides. There you go, good job. Now we can unfold that last step. Now we're gonna fold this corner to the center. See how we got a fold running down the middle? So that that's gonna give us a little guide fold, guide line. And we're gonna fold that corner right to the middle and crease Crease it down really well. Okay, and then we're gonna repeat that for the left side. Now this next step is a little tricky. We're gonna first unfold that last step. And then we're gonna fold this little, this little corner right here, the little triangle. We're gonna fold that inside. So we're gonna reverse the fold and we're gonna press it in like that and then squash it back down. Then we're gonna repeat the same step over here on the left side. So this little triangle shape, we're gonna, we can open it up like this. I hold it, I hold my thumb right here, and then I can open it up and then press it in like that and press it back down, squash it. So when you open it up, it should look like those little corners are inside. Now we're gonna fold our model in half. Okay, now that we have our this boat shape, we fold it in half, we can take each wing and fold it up. Now you might have your model flipped over like this, so just check to see which direction you have it pointed. But then we're gonna fold, we're gonna flip it over and we're gonna do the same thing over here. It should just open up and you should have this, this cool triangle shape inside. Now these are the two wings for our dove. All right, now position your model just like I have it. So we have this triangle going this way. Now we're gonna fold we're gonna fold the wing down. I'm gonna draw a line to show where we're gonna put the fold. So we're gonna put this fold right there. Is that cool? Yeah. So you don't have to draw a line like that at home. You guys can leave that off, but I'm just showing you so that you know where to fold it on your model. So we're gonna fold it down. Kind of like we're folding an airplane wing. Okay, now we're gonna flip our model over and we're gonna do the same thing with this wing. We're gonna fold it down and it should match the other side. See how the wings over here match? Yeah. All right, dude, we're almost done. Now we're gonna fold the tail. So this part over here, it's a bigger piece. See, we got a little piece over here and a big piece. This is for the tail. So we're gonna fold right along this edge. Okay, we're gonna fold it down right along that edge. Then we're gonna unfold that tail and we're gonna open up our bird down here on its belly and we're gonna reverse that, pull the tail in. Like that. Reverse the fold and it should be pointing down. Now the tail is pointing down. It's a little tricky. I'll unfold it and we can do that again. So this is how we had it, right? Yeah. Then we did this first fold. There go. Then we unfold it. We can open up our model down here in the bottom and then pull the wing or the tail inside. Cool? Yeah. Yeah, good job, you did it. Okay, now we got the tail finished. We're gonna fold the wings back up. Now we're gonna fold right along this edge right here. So we're gonna fold this wing up 
Good. We can flip our model over and then we're going to do the same thing, fold against that. It should be a real easy fold. Okay, now we have one last step and that's for the head. So we're going to fold. We're going to create another fold right here. Again, you don't have to make that pencil line, but we're going to fold the head down. And you should see it'll, it's going to make a little beak right here sticking out. Yeah, good job. Now we're going to unfold it. And we're going to do the same thing that we did on the tail. We're going to open up our bird. And then we're going to grab the beak and reverse it inside. Tuck it inside to the body. Okay, you almost got it. You fold it like this, then unfold it. And then we're going to open up the belly part right oh. here. And then tuck that in. Push that inside. Yeah. All right, now we can open up the wings like this, and we can also open the tail up a little bit more. And we got our cool little dove. Yeah. You did a great job, man. It turned out awesome. We hope you guys had a lot of fun following along and folding your own doves. Remember, if we ever went too fast, you can pause the video to take extra time. You know, another thing that would be really cool, you could put a hole in the top of this. Oh, yeah. Put a string through it and then you could hang it and it would look like it's flying. Yeah. That would be awesome. You can make like 20 more and do the same thing. Yeah, you could make a lot of these. Yeah. Make a flock of them. If you like this art project, be sure to click the circle to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And after you do that, click the bell icon to get notified when we do a new lesson. And if you really like origami, be sure to check out our playlist. It's full of more lessons. And we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.